Uh, hello everybody, uh, I am doing another thingy, uh, a vloggy thing, so uh, I started before I knew what to say really, um, let's see, uh, yeah my room's kind of a mess, um, it's like the end of the second week, my second week of, a full week of teaching, uh, what's happened, uh, okay first week I taught, uh, well, I teach at one elementary school and one uh, junior high. I can't think. I didn't. I don't really sleep much. Um, uh, <laughs> what's going on? Right. So anyway, first lesson on Monday. First lesson on Monday. I just had to introduce myself to like the year three kids, and that was that. That should have been easy. Although their obviously their English level is um, really low because they're they're year three, so they don't really know know anything they know how to say my name is um i don't know i can't remember any of their names now but uh anyway so i was doing that and i was like getting them to repeat what i was saying like hello and like my name is and i'm from here and stuff i asked the kid what his name was and he told me to die so uh that was my first lesson uh and then the second lesson was kind of the same um well i didn't get told to die in the second one fortunately uh, uh, but yeah, first one was pretty bad. Second one was probably better. I don't remember anything horrible happening after that. So the kids were all right after that. Uh, at the end of the day, I went to say bye to the principal because you're kind of supposed to go and kind of say like, uh, oh, I'm really, I'm really sorry for leaving before you. I'm going to be really rude and leave before you. And then they say like, nah, don't worry about it like go um so i went anyway i went to say bye to him and he's and he and he like just invited me in and i sat on on the couch and stuff and like we we he, yeah and he and he, we chatted or well we we failed to communicate for a little while and then uh another teacher who's in the teacher's room, which is right next to the to the principal's office. Um, I don't know, heard that I was in there, I suppose, and brought us both like green tea. So we, we sort of drank that and then failed to communicate a bit more. And then I went home. Uh, and that kind of happens every day. Whenever I go to say bye to him, uh, he, we, we, he invites me in. And then I'm like, I don't know how to say like, no, I don't, no, it's all right, don't, don't, you know, don't uh, do that, you know, <laughs> just, I've just come to say goodbye and stuff, but, so anyway, I've been having tea with him pretty much every day, that I'm there, that's the, um, the elementary school, I'm there three days, of, uh, three days a week, and then the junior high, I'm at two days a week, the Thursday and Friday, um, uh, second day, what happened? Uh, well, I don't know. Um, my hand's getting tired. My arm. Um, nothing really, I don't think. Nothing particularly special. Had tea with the principal again. Uh, third day, when, the Wednesday, last week, I had my... Was it last week? I don't know. Had my first earthquake, which was pretty uneventful, really. Uh, the walls just kind of shook a bit and like the teacher I think noticed first and then she told the kids to like get under the tables so they all got under the tables and I was just kind of like oh uh, well, what, what, what should I do you know so I just kind of stood around and then they had like an announcement over their, their like speaker things in, in the schools um, uh, uh, I couldn't understand it, obviously. Um, and then we waited for waited for a bit, and then the teacher we waited for a second announcement, and then the second announcement came, and then we just carried on with the lesson. So, uh, you know, I guess it wasn't bad. Um, yeah, yeah. Anyway, it didn't feel bad. And then I told the head mar uh, the principal when I was talking to him when he gave me tea again later the, later in the day and uh, he lent me this 
maybe you can't see it, it's not really in light there. He lent me this, which is uh, a book about the, the, the huge earthquake in, that they had in Japan, like um, uh, four years, nearly five years ago now, on, in, I think it was March the 11th, 2011. Uh, and uh, yeah, so that's got pictures in of the 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 earth the, uh, the earthquake the devastation in the town where I live. Um, so that was uh, I don't know. Well, it was nice of him to lend me it, but obviously not really not it's not really good. But yeah, so he lent me that uh, after I told him about it. After I told him about it being my first earthquake and all that. So he let me that. Um, what's happening at the junior high? Uh, none of the teachers really want to talk to me because I guess they don't really think they can. Um, uh, so it's kind of up to me and my Japanese is a bit, a bit crap at the moment. So I can't really talk with the teachers. So I don't know. It's, it's getting, it's, it's getting like better every day. So, you know, I just try, try to talk to them and, I, I, you know, they, I don't know, it's just quite hard because they're all in in the teacher's room, they're all Japanese and like I'm English and then like I have to kind of try and make conversation with them when everybody else who is obviously native Japanese speaker can hear my, uh, my crappy Japanese. So uh, yeah, it's quite hard to, uh, it's quite hard to talk to everybody but um, oh yeah, I, 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 I'm trying. Uh, I have lunch with the kids uh, at both schools, which is fun. The 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 elementary school is really fun because they're all I've eaten with like some of the year twos and and stuff, and <laughs> and they're just like uh, they just they all want me to sit at their table, which is quite funny. And then they're all they're all like asking me questions in Japanese, and I can't really understand them, so I just act like a just acts like a like a child really and that makes them laugh so it's quite fun uh, yeah that's quite fun I had a, a, sh a shishimo uh, the other week actually it was uh, I'll show you a picture uh, this is yeah I, I, I you know I didn't want to eat it and you you, you might see why uh, what's the best picture that's that's probably a good one Okay, I don't know really but what you can. Oh, hold on, let me try and. Yeah, that, I don't know. How do I fix this? Oh, okay. I don't know how well you can see that, but it looks like that. So you've still got the head on, and it's just like a fish corpse, basically. A, fi a, 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 a full fish corpse and then you eat that so the kids were just you know munching on it and I was just sort of looking at it not not really wanting not really wanting to eat it but what I did and it was actually really nice um, but the head's still on it and you know it doesn't doesn't look nice but it is um, uh, I can't really remember what else has happened um, uh, well, I've been trying to go out and sort of meet people, obviously, and uh, that's kind of quite hard because pubs are kind of different here. So I, I, I went out on a, I can't remember what day, probably it was Saturday last, not last week, week, the weekend before, anyway, doesn't matter. But I went out on a Saturday to try and go to a pub, and I went to a pub, and I went in, and the guys at the front like immediately were like welcoming me and stuff. And I was just like, hello, can I have a beer, please? And then, like, I just wanted to have a beer. That's all I wanted, just wanted a drink. But no, no, not an option. You have to sit down at a table. So I sat at a table on my own. Um, I was going to try and, I wanted to try and meet people, just talk to people and stuff, but they sit you at a table, so you have to have mates already, apparently. Um, so I was sitting on my own, and then they brought over, like, an appetizer, and I was like, I just want a drink. I just want drinks. Um, uh, so they bought me. They brought me a drink, and and then I just had that on my own, and then left. And you know it was rubbish. Um, and then 
Yeah, they call it a pub, but that's that's obviously not a pub. And then uh, went to tried to go to another place, and they just they just didn't really want me to go in. Uh, I think probably because I was on my own, and uh, yeah, they were kind of having like a bit of a party in there, so they didn't want some uh, weird guy in there just just sitting on his own drinking, I suppose. Um, yeah, I don't know what else is going on. Uh, what else is happening? Oh yeah, um, you may have seen that people like wear masks. They wear like white masks on their phone uh, in Japan. Um, yeah, that that happens a lot. Uh, like even at school, the kids in the classes. Um, I actually kind of counted. I think there were about thirty three kids in in one of the classes I had, and about nine of them were wearing the. I think nine of them were wearing the masks. So, you know, that's. It's quite a lot. Um, people on the trains wear them, and you know, in class, like they're just wearing them in class. Uh, the teachers, some of the, a couple of the teachers wear them. Um, so that's kind of funny. Uh, I'm just looking at what I've, I've tried to make a list of stuff to talk about, but oh yeah, so I got asked to talk about the the shops. The shops are pretty cool, maybe. Um, the you, well it, it's kind of funny they still send faxes in japan so i have to go and once i've finished making this video i've got to go and fax some stuff to work and, and that so they do that all in like convenience stores that sounds really american doesn't it like that's what they're called com com they're like a shortened version of the word convenience like conveni so that's why i started calling it out i suppose um anyway so you can fax stuff they all have ATMs that like charge you. Uh, uh, if you buy um, like kind of pre-prepared food, like rice and curry and things like that or whatever, uh, they ask you if you want it heated and they microwave it for you. Um, that's quite funny. Uh, they the 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 big kind of supermarket that I go to. Um, they start to um, reduce the price of their fresh food um, about an hour before close. So I usually go shopping about an hour before close to get like half price stuff. Uh, that's that, that's kind of good. Oh yeah. Also, when when you buy stuff, they kind of they put it in a basket for you. This isn't even. I don't really know why I'm talking about this, but they they put it in a basket for you. You can take you take a basket round. You put stuff in, and then they do they even put it in a different basket? I don't know. Anyway, they put it in a basket. Maybe the same one that you were using after they've priced it up and that. And then you move away from the till, and they've got like these little table things that you put your stuff on, and you do your bagging in the. <laughs> I just said bagging and thought of Halo. Um, uh, yeah, you you bag your stuff up in the thing, in the, on the on the thing. Um, I'm not even saying words on the table. Is it a table? Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, on the table or whatever it is. Uh, okay, so <laughs> right, what else is happening? Um, oh yeah, I, I think it's a bill. I think I got a bill. See, that's this is the problem. What is this? Uh, there's a bill here. Oh, there it is. So I got this. So yeah, I got this, which is good. So I owe fifteen hundred, I think, for electricity, which is about eight pounds. So no problem. Uh, I th I think actually they're just going to take this out. I think they just take this out. Um, I hope they do because, like, I haven't paid it yet. So. Oh, that's another thing they do at um, convenies, um, is uh, you can pay your bills and you can get stuff delivered there by like Amazon and stuff and pay for it at the at the shop and whatever. Uh, yeah, uh, and so yeah, yesterday I went to an open mic, which there's one in like a town kind of close to me. Uh, the town I live in is actually. Uh, I don't know. Well, so far I've not really found much here. Like, there's houses and 
and, and restaurants, I think. Um, so, uh, yeah, kind of not much um, so far. I'm sure there are places, but I, I, I haven't really looked. Anyway, so I went to this open mic yesterday, played and stuff, met all these people, and that was, that was good. And then uh, it started really late. I got there about seven, and then it didn't really properly start until about ten. Uh, by then it was like, well, I might as well, you know, stay, I've come to meet people, so I have to stay and talk to everybody. And then, yeah, missed the last train back, uh, a guy that I kind of know, um, uh, like, told me that I'd missed the last train and that he was going to drive back and that we'd probably get back about half one, uh, which is a bit late. And then on the way back, it was like, should we get some food? I was, and I sort of thought, yeah, might as well. I mean, it's already too late so uh let's get some food so we stopped and got some gyudon which i don't really know what it is it's like rice in a in a bowl with like meat on top um it was really good actually and then i had cheese on the top because that's what the guy said that's what he recommended so i had that um so i didn't get into about half two so then i didn't go to sleep till about three and then i had to get up at uh, seven to go to to go to my junior high uh, so um yeah so I can't really talk properly as I'm sure you've noticed uh, yeah my Xbox can't really get it online at the moment so um, for all of you people who are like desperately waiting to see when I come online um, yeah it's probably not gonna happen for a little while uh, but I can I can Skype if anyone wants to Skype uh, we are eight hours apart maybe nine hours because the clocks in Eng England will go back soon or whatever it is um yeah that's kind of it i think uh